Coach Nicoli, we're on the floor of CES 2017, first day. Like everything, it's a tremendously exciting show because the best and the brightest show up, hopefully to get everybody's attention. Uh, for the last couple of months, we've been conversing with some of your folks over Facebook, and we're looking forward to seeing what you had here. And obviously, this is a big show for you. Tell us what's uh, what's coming out of GDU this time. Yeah, you know, when it when it comes to GDU and really to the rest of the drone industry, it's all about innovation. That's the big name of the game. And 2016 was all about the folding drone. Really, what we're seeing for 2017 is the hot trend is modularity, and we're announcing our universal flying platform meaning that we can take one drone and use it for many, many applications. And a lot of times people have cameras that are attached to the drone. If that camera goes or it's just obsolete, that means the entire drone is obsolete. And what we want to be able to do is have a prosumer level camera on there that can also be switched out to a very commercial or industrial level camera or gimbal outfit that makes it very specific to the application needs of our users. So some of the big applications, especially for our infrared camera or our 10X optical zooming camera, that's full 4K camera, there's a lot in inspection, you got pipeline, you got highline wires, and really some of the initial interest is actually coming out of the insurance inspection. Think about hail when it hits an entire neighborhood, that could take somebody two weeks to finish that neighborhood off. You could take this drone, fly it 100 feet in the air, zoom in on everything, you're done in a couple hours. Talk to me about the capabilities and specifications of your primary vehicles. The Bird Premium 2.0 is one that we're also announcing here today, and the major difference on that one is the use of orthogonal frequency division multiplexing for the video transmission. The Wi-Fi can be interrupted a lot, and you never want the Wi-Fi to be interrupted when you've got something in the air. So OFDM is going to allow for a much more stable video transmission system, and then we've also got our different gimbal sets. So we've got the ILDC, which allows for up to five pounds of payload on a DSLR or a mirrorless camera. We've got the 10X zooming camera, and we've got the thermal camera, and then we've actually got a stretching gimbal, which is actually one of my favorites. A lot of times these editors and videographers have a problem with propellers getting into the top of the video. And that takes a lot of time in post to get rid of that. What we actually developed is a gimbal that stretches down well below the drone so that it's absolutely impossible to get that propeller clip in the video. Again, saving a lot of time for our videographers in post-production. Where do you see yourselves in the market within North America and then afterwards internationally? I would say that by the end of this year, we're going to be an absolute major player, especially when it comes to the commercial use of drones. And that's where we really see the big growth market is in commercial and industrial. And right now, we've got the only real vehicle system that is perfectly made for being able to use that modularity for the industrial. And then we are very quickly going to be moving globally. And we've got big presence in Europe and, of course, in China right now. How is GDU prepared to be able to support an American market? Yes, that's a great question. And we are rapidly expanding our U.S. presence right now to make sure that when somebody calls, they are actually speaking to somebody who easily understands their language and understands the policies and regulations of not just the country, but of their state. And we're also going to be rapidly advancing, probably by the end of the month, uh, office space in Austin, Texas, for customer support. So it'll be a lot faster and a lot easier. And we do recognize that customer support is essential to safe flight. And pricing and availability in these platforms right now? The new GDU Premium 2.0, the bird itself that comes with our 4K camera is 1049. This is one of the reasons why we know that we are going to be rapidly becoming one of the go-to platforms for both the prosumer and consumer and the industrial. Five pounds of payload screams take me seriously. Absolutely. It is a powerful, powerful drone here. And when you fly it for the first time, you really get a sense of excitement based on that power. But you also realize its potential. Aero TV is brought to you by... There's a difference between charting a steady course and pushing for the ceiling. And for nearly a century, Hartzell Propeller has been defining that difference. It's in our passion for engineering and research and our dedication to testing the limits of performance. We are built on honor. We are Hartzell Propeller. 
based on the popular Sling 2 LSA. The Sling 4 was designed to be the most practical and desirable lightweight four-place experimental aircraft on the market. Find out more about this 115-horsepower turbocharged airplane at AirplaneFactory.com.